A former chief judge of the family court has called for parents and schools to be held accountable for bullying. And he has the support of students in Melbourne's southeast, where teen suicide is becoming a major concern. Emily Angwin has the story. Jessica Cummings and Adelaide Asquith know firsthand what it's like to lose friends to bullying. Over the past 12 months, 10 of their peers have taken their own lives. One of my close friends, her brother, took his own life last year and just the, the absolute devastation that caused. Their pain is the reason former Family Court Chief Judge Alistair Nicholson is calling for tougher bullying laws. I've seen the consequences of, of bullying on families I've seen a lot of children who've been very detrimentally affected by it. Mr Nicholson says parents of tormentors and schools should be made legally liable. What we really need is a national approach to uh, this issue and I think the Commonwealth needs to look hard at it. But the Education Minister says current laws are adequate. We're very confident that that, uh, that legislation uh, will work in those circumstances. More than a quarter of young people say they're bullied on a regular basis and with social media yet another avenue for tormentors, Students like Jess and Adelaide have been prompted to act. They've set up an online petition and Facebook page but welcome discussion about the issue. We feel it's really important that the adults in our life start, start talking to us and start um, trying to help us out because you know, we're really struggling. For more details, head to our website. Emily Angwin, 7 News.